Manuel Sanchez's life ended in Melissa Gonzalez's backyard. The whole family was inside and we just we were watching TV. Suddenly, her family saw police, heard a crash, followed by gunshots. I was like, get down, get down. We all got down. Police cornered Sanchez in the backyard. He turned uh, and uh, pointed the weapon at the officer, and the officer was forced to use daily force. It was scary just to know he had a gun and he was trying to shit at the police, too. Tulsa police say it all started in Sepulpa, where they believe Sanchez was connected to at least two attempted carjackings. The first happened at the JJ's Superette convenience store. He fired a couple shots into the ground. Investigators say he didn't get far before there was another incident. We got the same uh, description of the same middle aged Hispanic male. About 20 minutes later, investigators say Sanchez showed up in the Taco Mayo parking lot near 4th and Utica, where he walked up to a customer in their car. Once the gun adding, Customers, you know, thinking, man, this is a robbery. He backs out, floors it. Police say he went to the car wash behind the restaurant and approached a woman there, then went into the neighborhood. He approaches uh, several individuals, points a gun at uh, at uh, these individuals, and demands their car keys. He didn't take the keys, but he ran away, and that's when officers finally caught up to him. We don't take it lightly when we have to take someone's life.